All right, YouTube, what's up? I'm back posting another vid. Uh, this is my albino red tail. Just after eating, you know, she's chilling out on the cool side of the tank. And uh, I think you guys saw her eat before in the vid I posted before, but uh, I really wanted to talk about the herb stat proportional thermostat that I got. Dude, this thing is, uh, kicks major ass right here. Um, I was uh, initially looking at a Helix and, uh, you know, I just heard a lot of bad things about the Helix, you know. Uh, I had heard, you know, it was a big hype about it before and I heard good things, but I also did hear a lot of bad things about it. So, uh, pretty much, I uh, not really rolled the dice, I would say, but I chose uh, the Erpstat, okay, proportional thermostat. And uh, and let me tell you that uh, the, the, the description and the service, you know, first of all, when I ordered it, it arrived in about two days. I ordered it on Saturday night. I know I wasn't going to get it shipped till, uh, you know, early, the beginning of uh, the following week, like on a Tuesday, I thought, and sure enough, uh, the actual owner of the Spider Electronics or Spider Robotics, one of the two, I think it's Spider Robotics, if I'm not mistaken. If I am, you know, apologize for that. But uh, pretty much the guy, uh, the owner called me up. You know, I asked him, I inquired about my order. He uh, didn't call me up, he emailed me, let me know they had packed my, uh, my system, my unit. And uh, sure enough, man, I mean, the service was excellent. It was super easy setup. Okay, uh, pretty much plug and go, place the probe, and uh, just just kicking ass right now. And this is what I like about this about this system right here, this unit. Right now, it switched over from uh, it was a red light. I preset uh, the temp at 92, and as soon as it's uh, it's reaching the the targeted temperature, it switched over to orange that indicator light and uh, it'll turn green as it approaches the targeted temperature. So uh, it's pretty much kick ass and it gives you peace of mind. And like I said, right out of the box, shipped it to me in this box right here. Uh, Spider Robotics, there you go. That's the that's the name and, uh, and, and right out of the box, man. I mean, you know, just read over the instructions really quick. It was, you know, quick setup, easy. And there you go, that light just turned green right now. So it's actually, uh, it's like a pulse. It shoots out a pulse to my heating elements, which by the way, I have two under tank heaters down there. And uh, this overhead, uh, this overhead uh, light, infrared light. So uh, to control the ambient temp inside the whole enclosure from overhead. So. Uh, and like I said, it's been working like a charm, and uh, it's just great, man. I mean, I'm glad that uh, that I got it. Excellent service, excellent product, and uh, it's, it's it's good. You know, I'm I'm super happy, and uh, you know, we'll see how it goes. So right now it's adjusting. You see the light, it kind of flickers. I don't know if you guys can see it or not, but it's kind of flickering. That's the pulsating, the, the power it needs to keep a steady temperature. And uh, another thing I like about this right here is that it has a nice bright display. Let me try to turn off the light. Junior, turn off the light really quick. Turn off the light too, buddy. Right here, uh, just has a kick-ass display. You can see it pretty much is dark and it's nice and bright. That's one of the other things people told me about the Helix uh, thermostat, that it doesn't have a good uh, bright display light. And uh, that was one of the things. I have two other thermometer units down there. They're Fluker uh, thermal hygrometers. And that's one of the major you know, issues I got. This is the other one over here on this side. You can't really see it. Turn on the lights, buddy. Turn on the lights again. Uh, 
one of the major issues I have is, you know, going and seeing the actual temperature, uh, seeing the display. It doesn't really, you know, I can't really see it right now, and I'm, you know, right up close on it. And uh, I think that's one of the other, uh, one of the other better, uh, you know, one of the better options. You know, you got a nice bright display in a dark, in a dark room where the lights are down and dim or what have you. So. Uh, Pretty much, man. Like I said, I'm, I'm super happy with uh, my purchase, and uh, you know, I, I know if later on, you know, two, three days or a week, it breaks down, and I'm gonna gonna be cursing, and you know, and, and probably I won't be as happy, you know, probably shoot another uh, vid, you know, cursing the thing. But um, I don't think so, from what I've heard, and from what the guys, uh, other keepers, you know, on YouTube and on, on forums. And reptile, uh, you know, websites or what have you. Uh, everybody says the herb status, you know, pretty much in the top of its game. It's American made, you know, another plus. It's made in the USA, so shit, you know, I support uh, our country's products, man. You know, we need some more stuff like this, you know what I mean? Some good quality products from the USA, and, you know, um, like I said, I don't know about the Helix, never owned one, never even seen one. Uh, so I don't know how accurate the information I've got. I'm just telling you from, uh, you know, word of mouth that I've heard pretty much. So I'm not trying to blast it, you know, by any means. I'm just trying to, you know, try to describe what, uh, what actually, what factor, you know, making my decision. It's mostly a uh, word of mouth. So see, right now, once it reaches. The desired temp, it kind of like flickers on and off. I'm not sure if I have it on proportional, proportional uh, what you mode, so I'm gonna double check that. But um, let you know. So I just want to make this quick vid. Uh, you guys, let me know what's up, and uh, let me know what you think. That's my son right there, Junior. Say what's up. What's up? So, pretty much, I'm out. Pretty much.